Alright. Seat belts are fastened. Fuel shutoff valve is on. So if I can go to friction. is disengaged. Circuit breakers are all in. Car fuel is off. Mixture is full rich. Mixture guard installed. Landing lights are off. The avionic switches are off. Clutch is disengaged. Altimeter is set to field elevation. Governor switch is on. So you haven't flown this, right? Yeah. Not today. three. One, two. It's just to do two. Okay, two. Roll into the detent. Verify closed. All right. Clear. Oh, I meant to ask. Oh. Um, have we done one of the autos? We have. Oh, we've done the short from the short final from. Okay. I know two we haven't done right. a lot. We haven't done a lot. We think we've done maybe two or okay. three. Today we'll practice some more. Let's go to Livermore and we'll do a bit pad alpha. Okay. Losing all the papers. Okay. Switch is on. Strong line is on. Time one hundred four hundred Zulu. Wind two five zero at one two. Visibility one zero. Sky condition few clouds one thousand seven hundred. Temperature one three two point six. Altimeter three zero one six. Visual approach runway two left in use. Arriving at departing runway is two eight. Notice to airmen use caution for cranes in the vicinity. Check notice for details. Hazardous weather information for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Advisors contact the Avitas Lima. Tower of Mission Lima, time one hundred four hundred Zulu, wind two five zero at one two, visibility one zero, sky condition few clouds one thousand seven hundred, temperature one three two point six, altimeter three zero one six, visual approach runway two left in use, arriving at departing runway is two eight. Notice to airmen use caution for cranes in the vicinity. Check notice for details. Hazardous weather information for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Advisors contact the Avitas Lima. Tower of Mission Lima, time 1904 Zulu, wind 250 at 12, visibility 10, 
Sky condition, few clouds, 1,700. Temperature 13, 2.6. Altimeter 3016. Visual approach, right to left in use. Arriving at departing runway is 28. Notice to airmen, use caution for trains in the vicinity. Check notice for details. Hazardous weather information for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Advisors, contact the elevators, Lima. Air tower information, Lima. Time 1 out of 4 out of Zulu. Wind 250 at 1 2. Visibility 1 0. Sky condition, few clouds, 1,700. Temperature 1 3, 2.6. Altimeter 3016. Visual approach, right to left in use. Arriving at departing runway is 28. Notice to airmen, use caution for trains in the vicinity. Check notice for details. Hazardous weather information for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Advisors, contact the elevators, Lima. 1,000, 2, 1,000. Air tower Lima, time 1 out of 4 out of Zulu. 1,000, Wind 250 at 1, 2. Back to Visibility 1-0. Sky condition, few clouds, 1,700. Temperature 1, 3, 2.6. Altimeter 3016. Visual approach, right 2, left in use. Arriving at departing runway is 28. Notice to airmen, use caution for trains in the vicinity. Check notice for details. Has this weather information for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Advisors, contact the elevators, Lima. What? Air tower information Lima, time 1 out of 4 out of Zulu, wind 250 at 1 2, visibility 1 0, sky condition, few clouds 1700, temperature 1 3, 2.6, okay, so altimeter 3 0 1 6, visual approach right to the left hand, the big hatch is with our cursor. Notice to airmen, use caution for the cursor. There you go, then you use the little hatch volume. This one? Hazardous weather information yeah. for California and coastal waters of Edmond flight service frequencies. Advisors, contact the elevators Lima. Yeah. Yes. There you go. Is that pretty good? Alright, yeah. Alright, then. Uh, Wind 250 at 1-2. back to the range. Visibility 1-0. Sky condition. How does it sound like that? Oh, okay. Temperature 1-3, 2.6. Altimeter 3016. Visual approach right to your left in use. Arriving at departing runway is 28. Notice to airmen, use caution for cranes in the vicinity. Check notice for details. Hazardous weather information for California and coastal waters available on flight service frequencies. Advisors, contact the elevators, Lima. Okay, Lima. Standard and 5 Sierra Tango, runway 28 left at Alpha 1, clear for takeoff. For takeoff, uh, 28 left at Alpha 1, Baron 5 Sierra Tango. Uh, what is 13.7E? E? What does the E mean? 65? I actually don't know. That's a good question. Sierra Tango, front rate departure frequency will be 135.65. Roger, Baron 5 Sierra Tango, clear for takeoff, 28 left. Okay, so 16. Hey, Tower, the Capital 234. Right, holding short, runway 28 left, request that left 270. Ready? Maybe it stands for electrical or something. Oh, that's a voltage, right? It is, yeah, it is actually a voltage. I don't know why they wouldn't just do a, a, v. a volts, but they probably put they put something there so there's a unit so you don't get it confused for the temperatures. I can collect reactions are off. Governors are on. Tango contact North Carolina departure, safe flight. Tango to departure, good day. The Castle on 5 0 X ray Tango make the left 270 departure, out of below 1000 feet into the region of midfield overhead. We got a runway 2 left, and correction, runway 2 left, and alpha clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, left 270, stay out of below 1000 for uh, 0 X ray Tango. Okay, so when you said like to do a partial clearing turn, I mean, would you do that before you call? Oh, yeah. So, uh, er, like, like, yeah, like, so like turn. turn. I think you could do it uh, either before or, or maybe after calling them is the uh, is the ideal time, but without waiting too long to actually take off. So if it's really windy, then yeah, I'd say just kind of stay pointed in the wind, make your call, and then when they give you the clearance, just turn, take a look, and then turn and go as you do your read back.
All right, so what do we want to do a right crosswind departure? Yeah, let's do a right crosswind departure and we'll head out towards Livermore. Taylor Tower, helicopter 479 or Sierra Hotel, at Meridian, requesting a right crosswind departure with Lima. Up to 479 or Sierra Hotel, Taylor Tower. Make a right cross and departure below 1,500 and east of three crosses. Taxiway Zulu Beam Meridian, clear for takeoff. Taxiway Zulu Beam Meridian, clear for takeoff. Right cross wind departure approved. Remain under 1,500 until east of three crosses. 479 or Sierra Hotel. 126011, gust 19. It's a little bit. When you the meat tower said. What's the what's the limit on when they would like cancel like a check ride? That's up to you. Oh really? Tango. How fast the winds do you think you can maintain private pilot standards in? Oh. Okay. Makes sense for that to be part of your decision making okay. as well. Yeah, because there's no wind limit on you as a private pilot. It's all up to your judgment. So the same thing for the check ride. It'll be up to your judgment as to. Uh, what you believe your limitation is. Now, if you uh, if it's five knots and you decide you don't want to go, then <laughs> <laughs> you might not pass. <laughs> yeah. But you know, if it's uh, you know gusting up to twenty or and you don't think that that's within your your limits to be able to perform to the PTS, then. Well, so what do you think is a reasonable limit for for a private pilot check right? Um. I think anything under 15 or under should be no problem. Uh, and then between 15 and 20, you know, maybe depending on the day, and then over 20, I'd say, is uh, yeah. is entirely fair game for yeah. uh, deciding to postpone. And some DPs like to handle a little bit differently. You know, they might, uh, one might prefer that you um, just cancel entirely if you don't, or postpone entirely if you don't feel like you can perform the standards. The other one might uh, want to give a go and like do the oral part. Yeah. I've already hit the direct two, but then ah. how do you get to the return? Oh, excellent question. It's kind of a weird thing that there's that extra step, um, but there you go. And now I have it set up. You can change what you want displayed. I have ground sea at the top. You have ETA, ETE distance and next, AGL, and you have desired track zero six eight and actual track 057. Okay, so uh, now, okay, so I highlighted the airport and then how do I get to the frequency? How do I get the ah, frequency? Good route? question. So down here it says airport info, go and hit that. And then oh, okay, on the no, side there, you have some selectors, you get frequency, and then whatever one you click will get pushed into the backup oh, okay, on your so radio. Press that, then it goes. All right, there's the little part. Gracious group, and there's zero tone. That came through kind of uh, poorly.
altitude of 10, sky clear, temperature 172.6, altitude of 3012. Visual approach in use, the landing department, runway 25 right, 25 left. Reddit Reds in effect, advise on initial contact information, hotel. Confirmation Hotel, 19530, wind 270012, visibility 10, sky clear, temperature 172.6, altimeter 3012. Visual approach in use, landing departing room with 25 right, 25 left. Red Red is in effect, advise on initial contact information, hotel. Bound to make straight in for runway 25 right, slow your speed if able. You're following a long easy currently on a seven mile straight in for runway 25 right, descending out of 3,800. I'll be slowing up here, entering, uh, entering and hit return to get into uh, right here. Long easy 6 November Golf, there is traffic uh, just south of Brushy Peak, altitude in case 2100 southeastbound Cessna is following you. Yeah, I'm looking for traffic, uh, 6 November Golf. Six to eight zero Victor, uh, negative contact. Number 8 zero Victor, your traffic follows uh, descending out of 3,500. You can uh, fly directly southeastbound uh, to intercept more of a seven mile straight in and then uh, the space needs to be adequate. Last transmission for 8 Victor. That's an 8 0 Victor. From your current position, just go ahead and make a right 360, a right 360 back to final for runway 25 right. Separation will exist. The altitude of the long easy is descending out of 3,200. He's currently 11 o'clock, 3 miles. Roger, right 360 and then long final for 25 right. 6 8 0 Victor. Tower, helicopter 479 or Sierra Hotel, eight miles to the west at 2000, uh, inbound for Cat Alpha with hotel. Helicopter 479 or Sierra Hotel, Livermore Tower, altimeter 3012, proceed direct to Pad Alpha. Direct to Pad Alpha, 479 or Sierra Hotel. Are you familiar with the uh, Pad Alpha pattern? Affirmative. Roger. Long easy 6 November Golf, runway 25 right, wind 28013, clear to land. Runway 25 right, clear to land, 6 November Golf. November 80, Victor, number 2, find the long easy, currently 3 mile final, altitude in case 1700, runway 25 right, wind 28013, clear to land. Clear to land, 25 right, number 2, 628, Victor. Attention all aircraft, use caution, there is more operations uh, south of runway 25 right between taxiways Echo and Golf.
Delta Niner Sierra Hotel, Pad Alpha Wind 290012, clear to land. Clear to land, Pad Alpha 4790 Hotel, thank you. Lights out top of the green, three in the green, fuel. RP sorry, full. Long DZ 69 November Golf, uh, are you parking south side or uh, face tower? Uh, Northwest Ramp, 6 November Golf. Roger, November 6, November Golf, right turn enable and contact ground, point six. Right turn at Echo, ground, one point six. Six November Golf. Cessna holding short of the right, Livermore Tower, you up, you ready? Livermore Tower, 90531 Delta, holding short, runway 25 right, uh, requesting uh, simulated Livermore 3 departure. Delta 9531 Delta Livermore Tower, runway 25 right, wind 290012, clear for takeoff. Simulated Livermore 3 departure is approved and traffic on one mile final Cessna. 25 right, clear for takeoff, 9531 Delta. Cessna 80 Victor, traffic departing prior to arrival, Cessna taking the runway. Roger, 80 Victor. Charlie X ray, 12 north, Los Flaqueros with the hotel landing. RV 16 Charlie X ray, Livermore Tower, enter a right base for runway 25 right. Right base? I've never seen anyone right. out here before. Oh. They're fishing. What kind of luck they're having <laughs> there's in there? How <laughs> about that? Baby. I don't think there's going to be a lot of fish. Maybe they're just sport fishing. Maybe it's a catch and release. Oh, I feel like Why are they in the one that's all colored? Why aren't they in the nice like blue the, one? Yeah. Well, maybe they're not allowed in <laughs> Who knows? Maybe they know something we don't. <laughs> maybe there's a special kind of fish in there. That's right. A five-eyed fish. <laughs> So while we're down here, we can see wind direction is kind of a decent strength coming out of that way. Zero Victor, contact ground point so we'll set up to practice some 180 yeah, autos. Right. We'll do them from 1,000 feet, which is going to give us 600. So about 200 feet less than we there's get traffic, practicing uh, on 28 right. Just the tower the now on a simulated wind morphine departure. We're going to take 1,700 right. um, So what we'll want to do... So 1,000 MSL, you're saying? That's the 3 yes. Delta okay. traffic just yeah. south of so Los Angeles. Of course, the same as usual, full down collective, a little bit backside. We can maintain the attitude, but we're just going to start our turn pretty much right away. We'll get up, and we'll enter when we're a beam to the spot, and then start that turn. You can adjust your accuracy forward or back by either turning tighter. If you turn and go straight towards the spot, you'll get closer or go further. And then if you uh, see you're getting a little too close, you just kind of ease off the turn. You get more, uh, more glide. You follow a larger distance around, and you'll be in a little bit shorter. So you can either loosen or tighten the turn to adjust whether you're going to hit. It's actually a lot easier to keep these accurate than it is the straight ends because you do have that flexibility. All right. um, the tighter you turn, the more you load the rotor system, right? And the more you load the rotor system, the more the rotor RPM wants to go up. So the tighter the turn, the more the RPM is going to try and go up. So you need to pull up collective when you turn. And remember to push down collective when you roll out. Especially that last roll out when you go back flat, there'll be a decent amount of down collective. Okay. Otherwise, the RPM will, will fall out. RV16 X-ray, runway 25 right, wind 27012, clear to land. All right. Clear to land, 25 right for 6 trial X-ray. 
Let's go ahead and give this a go. Let's ask for it. left close traffic pad alpha. We'll climb up and out, we'll get up to a thousand and we'll turn into a nice tight little downwind. Alright. Can I turn the intercom down a little bit? Yeah. Maybe I turn it up a little bit. We'll go to fifty five. How's that? Alright. Better? Yeah. Livermore Tower, helicopter 4790 hotel, request left traffic to Pad Alpha. Southern 90 Hotel, Pad Alpha 1, 27013, clear for takeoff, clear to land, traffic uh, entering on the left 45, left traffic to the tower for the tower pattern. Looking for traffic, clear for takeoff, clear to land, left traffic, Pad Alpha, Pad Alpha, 4790 Hotel, thank you. Tabria 3 Alpha Charlie, there is traffic departing from Pad Alpha in the helicopter type pattern. Uh, runway 25 left, wind 27013, clear for the option to on and go, left close traffic approved. Okay, we're looking for the uh, helicopter and clear for the option 25 left, 3 Alpha Charlie. Or 3 1 Delta contact, North Carolina approach 125.1. 125.1, 9531 Delta. Let's keep using your power, get yourself up there. climb really nicely now. The one will make our turn here. And you're just basically nice and tight. There won't be a cross when you'll just continue the turn around because we want to be just right around the uh, edge of this reservoir. So keep turning. Oh. There we go. It's going to be a fairly tight turn. Yeah. Uh, tower, so oh, Where's that helicopter thousand. now? Tower 3 Alpha Charlie, that uh, previous call to helico helicopters in a left uh, downwind now for Pat Alpha. His uh, pattern is inside of your pattern for the left. Cool. Um, All right, here is Pat Pat Alpha operations. He's at or below 800 feet. Okay. Okay, thanks for that 3 Alpha Charlie. It's on top of the green 3 and the green fuel farm. Cool. All right. We'll enter in 3, 2, 1. So push full down, roll off, start the turn. Now watch the RPM, it'll come up here. There you go, just a little bit of pull more. Or left pedal for trim. There you go, now we're in trim. So we can turn around. And just keep coming, push down, collective as you roll out, and then a little up and smooth flare. There we go. So you can see that wind definitely pushes on us a decent amount. Yeah. Oh, I see. Um, That's why we kind of made it short, because... Yeah, exactly. Um, oh, I see. You were looking at the... Power, Cessna 31 Delta coming back in. We're having some electrical issues. Cessna 9531 Delta, Livermore Tower, Roger. Your right base entry for runway 25 right is approved. Uh, wind 29011, clear to land. And do you require any assistance at this time? Negative, we're fine. And uh, right base 25 right, 31 Delta. RV16 sector contact ground point six. Ground point six. Um, you had a little bit too much right pedal. Um, you saw we pushed yeah. back on the left when we came back in trim. That'll help out with your glide as well. That'll uh, if you're out of trim, you're gonna have a lot more drag. All right. So one hundred eight here, pop a little more tower again. Uh, we are inbound for the RNAV for two five right. One hundred eight up on that. So 108 here, Papa Livermore Tower, Roger, runway 25 right, continue on the approach, report a four mile final, and expect your clearance there. Continue on report, four mile final, please, yeah, Papa. Livermore Tower, watch the 4 kilo ready for departure, 25 right. The fun radio. Velocity 84 Kilo Juliet, Livermore Tower, runway 25 right, wind 29011, clear for takeoff, say departure request on the go. Uh, we're going to uh, go for Tracy, so eastbound. Four kilo Juliet, Roger, you're right down when departure is approved. And we are cleared for departure for eight four kilo Juliet. Hey, firm day. Alright. Five we're ready for departure. Oh, right. Almost. Just one five single off a little more tower. I'll pull up two and hold short of runway two five right, you're next to the sequence. Hold short, two five right, one five tank off. Livermore Tower, helicopter 4790 Hotel, request left traffic, Pat Alpha. Helicopter 90 Hotel, Pat Alpha, 128011, clear for takeoff, clear to land. 
Foster, take off to land, left traffic, call your alpha, 4792. Velocity 4, Kilo Julia, extend your upwind, I'll call your crosswind, and that pits will be turning inside of you. 84 Kilo Julia, Roger. Pits 5, single off, runway 25 right, wind 28011, clear for takeoff, and your early right crosswind to approve. 25 right, clear for takeoff, early right crosswind, 15 tango alpha. Delta 3, one Delta traffic departing, prior to arrival, pits rolling. Uh, Blossom, A4 Kilo, Juliet, can I go ahead and uh, make a turn here? Or 4 Kilo, Juliet, A4 Miss. It is uh, 3 1 Delta, clear for uh, lane. Number 3 1 Delta, A4 Miss, clear to land. Clear to land. Keep turning. Delta 3 1 Delta, Out top of the green, three in the green, fuel, car and peak, pulling full car and peak. All right. We'll enter in three, two, one. So we'll push down, roll off. Nice turn. A little more left pedal for trim. Here comes the RPM back up. So just a little check there. Won't need quite that much. We'll keep turning the helicopter around, driving towards the spot a little bit down, collective for RPM. As you roll out, push down. Yeah, that RPM wants to drop, and then back up a little bit for the flare. Smooth flare, flare, flare. And there we go. Nice. That one looked better. As you would expect, of course, because it was the uh, second one that we did in a while. This is just a little bit too much right pedal. Keep an eye on your chart. Uh, Charlie, uh, Charlie uh, uh, taxiing back for... Uh, only about uh, two-thirds of that right pedal. Charlie, 3-off, Charlie, a little more tower. Roger, you can uh, taxi with me, runway 25 left via Lima, Charlie. Okay, 25 uh, left via Lima, Charlie, 3-off, Charlie. Are you looking for that? Like, when you go to Rock Hill, are you looking at the trip streets? Let's take a glance at it after you've entered. Once you have it set, it won't go anywhere. Um, and then, what else was I going to say? Oh, you'll find it'll be easier to manage RPM, push down, and then as it's coming back up, give it just a little bit up, so it just slows down on its way up. That way it's easy to stop it where you want it, you don't have to pull a lot, so you have to stop all at once, you don't have to bring it back down. Uh, we're headed over to, uh, Tracy. Uh, that was during the turn, or when it was Initially. Yeah, so it's full down, and then come a little bit up, so just so the RPM slowly goes back up. Uh, if you let it accelerate to upwards, right. you have to pull a lot to get it to stop. Remember, 5151 Bravo, Livermore Tower, fly southbound to make straight in for runway 25 right. You're following a Cessna, 7 mile final straight in. Uh, runway 25 right, 5 on Bravo. And velocity 4 Kilo Juliet, there is traffic 12 o'clock, about 5 miles in a southbound turn. Cessna altitude indicates 3,800. Frequency chain approved. 84 Kilo Jet, Roger, thank you. Livermore Tower, helicopter 4790, tower request left traffic, Pat Alpha. Helicopter 90, tail Pat Alpha, wind 28011, clear for takeoff, clear to land. Clear to takeoff, clear to land, left traffic, Pat Alpha, 4790, thank you. That's a 5 1 Bravo, there is traffic, 1 o'clock, about 4 miles northeast bound along the freeway altitude, in case 2500 velocity. Okay, for traffic, 5 1 Bravo. Alpha Charlie, ready for takeoff. Tower three, three, Alpha Charlie, live more tower, runway two five left, wind two eight zero one one, cleared for takeoff, left post traffic approved. Uh, takeoff two five left, and left pattern. Three Alpha Charlie. Right. 
attention all aircraft, some of signing call signs on frequency Cessna 738 Sierra Papa and Cessna 198 Sierra Papa, use full fire. Lights out top of the green, three in the green two. Cessna one nine or eight Sierra Papa number one, runway two five right wind, two eight zero one two, clear to land. Number one for two five right one nine or eight Sierra Papa. Cessna five one Bravo, are you uh, requesting a full stop? Full stop, Cessna five one Bravo. There you go. You can leave Roger, the collective bird to see how the RDM is coming back. If you more of a squared off southbound base for runway that 25, looks like, I'd expect the yeah, power just a little bit the high. Now. We'll be turning just uh, out. behind the traffic with the on the turn a little bit. That's it. High about that. There we go. Cessna the wind's really three pushing us away on this You are one. number two following the Cessna on a three no and a half mile straight in runway 25 right wind, two nine or zero, one two. Now full flare. All right, look at that. See how you kind of bled your airspeed too high there? So that was that was kind of the only uh the only mistake I noted. Even if the horns so going off at the beginning, Charlie, that's two fine. Five left um, two eight zero one I'd rather the RPM come up slowly than the than trying to make the horn never go okay, off. Okay, clear for the option. Two five left. Uh, three off Charlie. But yeah, other than that, no, just wait a little bit longer before you flare. Okay. Livermore Tower, helicopter 4790, hotel, request left traffic to Pat Alpha. Helicopter 900, hotel, Pat Alpha, wind 28012, clear for takeoff, clear to land. Clear takeoff, clear to land, left traffic, Pat Alpha, 4790, hotel. So 5 1 Bravo, do you have your traffic to follow inside? He's in a right base now, about your 1 o'clock. Uh, looking for Dante, 5 1 Bravo. Alright, lights out top of the green. Green, dual car, beautiful. Remember 5 1 Bravo, you are number 3 at this time, following the Cessna ahead of you on a 1 and a half mile final runway. Right wind 27013, good land. Number 36, not five, not Alright, 3, 2, 1. There you go, so glance, see where the spot is. Now look inside, check our PM. There you go, nice. So we'll continue the turn. As you roll out, nice job pushing down. Get that RPM up in the green. Now smooth flare. flare a little bit too big of a flare. Yeah, you see yourself coming back up. Attention all aircraft, live more information. So on that one, you waited just barely too long to start the flare. You had a lot of extra energy as you got low. You can play with that to get to stay nice and low, but if you just kick the nose back just a hair at 40 feet and slowly build that full flare, you'll have an easier time getting it to level out right where you want. Um, but I did really like the, the entry and the turn, just keep an eye on that RPM, it got a little bit high initially. Uh, so make sure that our, that collective comes back up. Uh, and then, uh, I also liked how you uh, lowered collective as you rolled out, so it kept the RPM up in the green for you. Cool, let's ask for a straight out departure, and then uh, kind of halfway back. We'll practice some simulated engine failures using the uh, this new turning skill that we've learned. All right. Cessna 80, pop right turn, next exit, contact ground point six. Right turning, contact ground point six, one nine or eight zero, pop up. 
Livermore Tower, helicopter 4790 Hotel, request straight out departure. Helicopter 90 Hotel, Livermore Tower, Pat Alpha Wind 28012, cleared for takeoff straight out departure approved. Clear for takeoff straight out departure is approved. 4790 Hotel, thank you. Tower, this is 20503, ready to go, uh, 25 right, right, uh, I'm going to be right down with departure. Alright, 20503, Lubomar Tower, hold short runway 25 right, arriving traffic, and I have your request for right down. Hold short 25 right, right. Tower 3, Alpha Charlie with me, runway 25 left, taxi via Lima Charlie. Okay, Lima Charlie to 25 left, 3 Alpha Charlie. Seven three eight Tierra Papa without delay right turn taxiway Charlie and contact ground point six one off please. All right without delay. Automatically go a little bit to the left to stay out of like two eight left. Yeah, like two, just left. drift a little bit left, yeah. not a ton, because you don't want to be in the kind of extended downward, yeah. but just a just a tiny bit of room. It's better to err on this side than the other side. Yeah. yeah, this is a. This is a good spot to be. A little more tower, Centurion 6202 Bravo, Delta Mod inbound, India landing. Centurion 6202 Bravo, little more tower, make sure you're runway 25 right, report a four mile final. 25 right, four mile final, 6202 Bravo. 051 Bravo, right turn, when able, contact ground, point six. Right now, uh, after wait, contact the ground, uh, five number about. Number five zero three, runway two five right, wind two eight zero one three, cleared for takeoff right down, when departure is approved. Two five right, clear for takeoff uh, right down, five zero. Alpha Charlie, ready for takeoff. So tap rear three, Alpha Charlie, runway two five left, one two six zero one three, clear for takeoff, left slow traffic approved. Uh, clear takeoff, two five left, three Alpha Charlie. Centurion zero two Bravo, runway two five right, one two six zero one two, clear to land. Clear to land, six two zero two Bravo, two five right. Okay. Helicopter nine or Sierra Hotel, three ten three. Previously change approved for seven nine zero Hotel, thank you. Watch your speed. Hello, my tower. Good afternoon again. Twin Cessna 410, November Contract, 3500 approaching the Alps, uh, full stop landing.
we had uh, a little more power failure here. Where do you think that might happen go? Over Del Ball Dam inbound with India? I'd probably go that way. I'd probably, because the wind's coming this way, I'd probably go to a 90. Okay, but where would we land? Oh, where? Uh, let's see, where would I make it? Twin Sense of 410 November, Fox Hot Livermore Tower. Make sure it ain't runway 25 right there. It's traffic off your left wing about three side. miles. Up to the NK 3400, like, southwest really bound type unknown. So let's have a right edge of failure here. Base flight 19, well, let's start left Livermore instead. Tower, fly north bound for straight in front way 25 left. There we go, so again, establish, I'll come back up if you bring the nose up a little bit too. There you go, there's a field down to our left, that's pretty nice. So let's set up for that. Number 437, Foxtrot Alpha, Livermore Tower, State type aircraft. This is Skyhawk, what's going to be used off? There you go, so keep coming out this way. You can give yourself a little bit more room, I'd say, because then you turn. Along the freeway there to intercept the straight in front way 258. Right now we're on top of it, so we don't have to fly. But that's where we could go, but you need to give yourself more room. There we're bringing the power in and we can climb back up out. And keep the speed up around 50. There you go. So, and that one, considering uh, wind direction as well as what angles we can approach it from, it's not too bad if we want to come in from any side, but there's some taller trees on the east and west, uh, and it's also a little bit longer running north and south. So we came in from the south, approaching towards the north, and maybe angle in a little bit up towards uh, the west. That would turn out really well, uh, which is kind of what we did. Uh, we just a little bit too tight on top of it to, uh, to get into the spot. Air work, B flight 19. Base flight 19. Oh, we'll go ahead and keep going. Pattern work, B flight 19. B flight 19, number two, follow us to Tabria, left base, runway 25 left, clear for the option of the go left, close traffic. Uh, number two, clear for the option, uh, close traffic, 25 right, or left. Twin system zero, November Foxtrot, runway 25 right, clear to land number one. Land, uh, two, five, right. Cessna 7, Fox, right. Fox right off, and number 2, follow Twin Cessna ahead, runway 25 right, clear for clear to land. 25 right, clear to land. Guess with this much wind, you can't really go, go that glide that far. Up wind. Cessna 7, Fox, right off, option approved. Get that uh, decent ways. So, option approved, right close traffic, so Fox right off. I mean, I would have to like take more or something like this versus like six, 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 out there. Yeah. There's a more adjacent to runway 25 right on the south side midfield. I mean, a lot of what's out in front of us isn't ideal for spots to aim for. Yeah. There's a little one down there, but we'll have to be pretty accurate to hit that. Going into a, a slope isn't ideal, because um, it's hard to flare and yeah. land nicely on that. You mean this one right here? Yeah. Maybe over there wouldn't be as bad. But yeah, yeah, the little cul-de-sac down there would be pretty nice. Yeah. Well, we could make that. Well, let's find out. A little more left pedal. There, now you're over trim. I think we're a little bit high. Yeah, we'll definitely be over the top of it. All right, we can bring the power in. Oh, we'll climb up. Let's go back to the same spot. Let's try that again. Where do we start from? Let's go back to where we're kind of up over. Uh, we'll just kind of climb up and then turn back towards Hayward. Okay. Yeah, so you're using a little bit too much right pedal on the entry, and you're putting yourself out of trim um, from the start there. And I would say, other than that, just smooth out the turns a little bit. Maybe it's the turbulence, but it's feeling a little bit of. Uh, just a little abruptness, and that's adjusting your RPM. Oh, 
let's make our left turn here. Yeah, tower, Starboard 3 Alpha Charlie, taxi back. Starboard 3 Alpha Charlie, ground point 6. Okay, go on to ground 3. I'll come up a little bit higher, give yourself some room to uh, play around with it. Where was it? Oh, okay, down. Yeah. Engine failure here, so full down collective, right pedal, a little back cyclic. Let that RPM come up nice and gentle. All right, now we're going to overshoot from here, so let's uh, make some adjustments so that doesn't happen. Cross runway 25 left at Golf, contact ground point 6 on the south side, traffic is short final. Left turn cross 25 left, ground point 6. Watch the pitch attitude of the helicopter, see how your way nose up, now your way nose down. RPMs dropping because of that. There you go. Now turn towards the spot. This is looking better. But adjust for that. There we go. All right, we're going to power in and we can recover here. There you go. So that one would have been maybe just a slightly, slightly long, but much better. Uh, so I noticed as you're turning, you're bringing the nose either up or pushing it down. Oh, okay. Um, so we lost a lot of speed in the turn, and then as you exited, you put the nose down, and we dropped to about 90% RPM. Uh, so keep an eye on that. Try and just make those just nice, smooth, level turns, and that will make everything a lot easier as well. So we'll head on back towards Hayward. And right. we'll plan to go into uh, Meridian. All right. As it is information for Northern California available on flight service frequencies, I advise contact. Do you have information, Mike? Here we're information, Mike. Two zero five four Zulu, wind two five zero one three. Visibility one zero. Sky clear. Temperature one three. D point six. Altimeter three zero one five. Please your approach and use landing runways two eight. No chairman. Multiple cranes in the area. Check local modems for further information. As it is information for Northern California available on flight service frequencies. I advise contact. Do you have information, Mike? Where's the? How come I don't see the tower? Oh, here we go. Hey, we're confirmation, Mike, 2054, Zulu, wind 25013, visibility 10, sky clear, temperature 13, D.6, altimeter 301. Yeah, hit return, it recenters. Yeah, one Charlie Bravo, verify you're about four miles out. Uh, 4.1, FM, one Charlie Bravo. Princess one Charlie Bravo, runway yeah. 28 left, clear to land. Clear left, clear to land, one Charlie Bravo. Oh, is that Mike? Uh, yeah, I think so. Mike. That sounds right. Right. Hayward Tower, helicopter 4790 Sierra Hotel, six miles to the northeast at 1,800, requesting uh, inbound for Meridian with Mike. Helicopter 4790 Sierra Hotel, Hayward Tower, Roger, enter a correction, actually cross overhead midfield for left traffic, taxiway Zulu. Cross overhead midfield for left traffic to Zulu, 4790 Hotel. 
Uh, one Charlie Bravo, uh, just confirm clear to land, 28 left. Turns out someone, Charlie Bravo, affirmative, runway 28 left, clear to land. Clear to land, 28 left, one Charlie Bravo. Justin 272, contact Oakland Tower. Contacting Oakland 272. Across the midfield at 800 or more, like a thousand. thousand. Yeah. Because you want to, uh, you would ideally be another 500 feet over the pattern the altitude, pattern altitude but that takes us um, higher up than they want us because of Oakland. So we have kind of a weird. Okay. Captain Manor, your tele traffic uh, about two and a half miles east of your position, flying towards Cal State, inbound to Oakland Northfield. Citation, sending out of 3,800. All right, looking. Looking for traffic, 4792. I don't see him yet. Cessna 1, Charlie Bravo, right at Delta, cross runway 28 right, contact ground point 4. Right at Delta, cross 28 right, ground point 4, 1, Charlie Bravo. Thank you, runway 28 left, clear to land. Clear left, clear to land, clear to land. traffic, no factor. Helicopter 4790, hotel traffic to short final landing, 28 left is a Cessna. Taxiway Zulu, a beam, Meridian, quick one. Taxiway Zulu, a beam, Meridian, third land. Looking for traffic, 4790, Yeah, I don't see him yet. Go and take it a little bit closer to Meridian. Let's hold a thousand.
I want to go nice and tight. Oh, what? I said, I want to go, let's go nice and tight, kind of between Meridian and the helipads there. Oh. Ah, there's that Cessna. All right, all prep for landing. All right, engine failure. All right, so it's gonna be a bit of a tight turn here, so we'll be ready to make that. There we go. Just a little bit down on collective through here. As we tighten the turn, tiny bit up, keep that speed. There we go, lined up, drop it in, nice little up, smooth flare, flare, flare. Awesome. Thank you. Right where we wanna be. All right. Nice job. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah, all right. <laughs> cool, we'll go and um, so let's just I'll slide down side. the other side. We've got a little more room. We'll go between 4 Victor Bravo and 290. If you can, keep the nose pointed where you're going for now. So turn around. Turn to put your, or sorry, give yourself a tailwind. So face the spot you want to go to. A little bit slower through here. Keep it kind of a walking pace, especially around other objects. And then go all the way to where you want to be. And then that'll turn in place. Hey, we're Tower Skyhawk 91934. Uh, request uh, 28 left. Hey, we're Tower Roger Cross, overhead, midfield for left traffic, runway 28 left. Cross overhead for left traffic, 28 left, 934. Stewart Tower, Sir, 221 Fox Lima is uh, four miles north uh, northeast uh, for landing with Mike. Sir, 221 Fox Lima, Lima, hey, we're Tower, enter right base, runway 28 right. There, you're just going to have to uh, right. just dance with the wind a little bit. It might be uh, the corner of the hangar messing with us right now. The wind's coming from that angle. There you go, nice. Let's kind of keep... Just one Fox Shot Lima, wind to 260, gust 20, runway 28 right, clear to land. One Fox Lima, clear to land, 28 right. Just one Fox Shot Lima, traffic just coming out of Oakland, we'll be crossing overhead midfield. This is Cessna, currently at 1,200. One Fox Lima, I'll be looking for. Niner, one three four traffic over Cal State and Mon for two eight right to Sirius is sending out at one thousand four hundred. Number one, runway two eight left, clear to land. Niner three four, runway two eight left, clear to land. Oh, here, I'm gonna leave this on because that's our um, intercom as well. Oh. I know, I'm used to the other helicopters too yeah. where it stays, it on, stays on, but the, the ICS is through there, so we turn it off, then we can't talk to each other anymore. or two minutes, whichever comes first. Yeah. And under kind of typical circumstances, they would both happen at about the same time. It's probably going to happen about the same time. Yeah, it's looking pretty decent. But I guess it makes sense because it's uh, 15 out.
one Fox Charlie, my right turn one, you're able, ground point four. Ground point four, one Fox Charlie. Current winds are two seven zero at one five, gust two zero. Good afternoon, November 530, Juliet Whiskey, visual 28 left. Regional 530, Juliet Whiskey, here with tower, your number two flying fast in a very short final, runway 28 left, clear to land. 28 left, clear to land, number two, 530, Juliet Whiskey. And current winds are 260 at 15, gust 20.